I yield myself as much time as I may consume. Without objection. And you're recognized, sir. I, I speak today in support of the Moving Americans Privacy Protection Act, which will require the U.S. Customs and Border Protection ensures that personally identifiable information is not publicly disclosed during an international household move. Customs is currently required to adequately protect personally identifiable information that is provided on, among other things, international shipping documents. In order to fulfill this mandate, Customs currently maintains procedures that allow shippers to request confidential treatment of certain information. However, it can often take Customs several months to make a determination on such a request. Some determinations are not even made until after the information has already been publicly disclosed. That's the problem. As a result, personally identifiable information has been mistakenly disclosed to the public. This impact has been acutely felt by U.S. civil servants and military personnel, which make up a large percentage of international household moving. Disclosing this information has increased the risks that individuals may be the victims of identity theft and credit card fraud. In my view, the current systems at Customs is not working as well as it could or should. I also do not believe that individuals should bear the burden of making a proactive request to Customs to ensure that their personally identifiable information is not publicly disclosed. We should be able to expect that our government will protect such sensitive information. This bill is intended to rectify the problems by mandating that Customs put in place a proactive system that will prevent personally identifiable information from being made public. I call on my colleagues to support this common sense legislation that has support on both sides of the aisle. Mr. Speaker, I reserve the balance of my time. The gentleman reserves. The gentleman from Washington is recognized. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, I would like to yield five